Hey all, Teague here. So, I want a big shout out to uh, JB Alters, who was a big help. I reached out to him on Reddit and he helped me build this section. Um, so you're gonna see a lot of his altars here. But basically, we created an altar section. Love looking at altars. Um, wanted a better way to look at them. I feel like I always see them in one off, so I check them out on Reddit. Um, so we made a way that you could actually organize and view altars. So I just selected artifacts. We're checking out artifacts. And these are all JB altars, awesome altars. So just showing you how that works. Um, I'm going to go back to all. You can actually pick altars such as me, Teague, and JB altars. And I'm actually uploading his own altars because I don't have any of my own, just for tests. Um, so you can select by the altarist. Uh, you can do types or you can do color or you can search and so there's pack rat right there so when you click on one you can actually see more information um, and it also shows the original card which is really cool so you see comparisons his pack rats are far greater than the original pack rat here um, you can also comment here like awesome alter dude which is kind of nice just the way to let the artist know what's up um, and then if you notice over here too, it says I'm taking commissions. <clears throat> so this isn't shown by default. Um, it's shown if you guys want to support. Uh, it's If you do any of the paid memberships, you get to like, advertise that you're taking paid commissions over here. Um, otherwise, you just upload all you want. This just won't show up, so you don't have to pay to do this. The, really, the purpose is to get a great database of all the altars um, out there because they just love looking at the art, love the collection of them. It's really cool. So I'm going to show you how to actually upload them. Um, so when you're in the altar section, you have to log in. Uh, accounts are free. And then you click Add Manager Altars. And it jumps you over into the My Account section. Uh, so I have this on my desktop here. So I have a couple altars. I'm just going to take them and drop them. So it's a pretty sweet little setup. Um, and as they actually upload, they will pop up down here. And then once they pop up down there, you need to assign a card to them, and we'll show you how that works once they're finished uploading with each other. Any moment now. I guess while we're waiting for this, we can also down here, you can choose to delete items, or you can view and edit them. Um, when you view and edit them, it actually brings you over to the altars page, each individual altar page, and from there you can actually write a description or keywords. You can even put what you think the value of the altar is. So here we go, we're starting to get the first uploads. So as they come in, this is Underground Sea. So I might be just searching for it and it's actually revised. So set that and set Dark Confidant. Oops. Since it's uploading, it kind of has a little lag, so Dark Confidant. Uh, full Strix, a Wasteland, and yes, an Altered Black Lotus, which is ridiculous. So there you go. So now those are done, and from here you can choose to delete something. Um, since I have the Black Lotus twice, I'm just going to delete this one, show you how that looks. And you can choose to view edit them. So I'm going to view edit. And you can see the card uploaded. If you notice over here, you can actually like type in your information on each page. So you can write a little bit of description. I wrote this, uploaded as a test. Put a value to it if you want. And then you can do comma separated search terms. It's like acrylic or peel or whatever you want to put here. Eventually, there'll be search against these comma separated search terms. Um, and if we go into the author section, we'll notice that the items I just uploaded are shown there, which are awesome and they're already searchable. Um, so there's our two dark confidants, the one I uploaded and the one by JB Alters. So have fun with this, guys. If you have any feedback, just leave it in the comments. Thanks a lot.